The women's semi-finals of Australian Open 2006 pitted two former world number ones against each other. 2004 champion Justine Enna Arden had come from a set down to defeat top seed Lindsay Davenport in the quarterfinals, while 2004 Wimbledon champion Maria Sharapova had breezed through to the last four without dropping a set. This was the fourth career meeting between the pair, with the Belgian having beaten the Russian twice, including most recently on the way to her 2005 French Open title. With searing temperatures outside, the extreme heat rule was employed and the decision was made to close the Rod Laver Arena roof. We join the action with Anna Arden, up a break at 4-3 in the first set. Two excellent first serves. Head out then. Yes, well, you said you've got to try and break back right away, and it's Sharapova that's yes, been the aggressor in this game. Hen and yes. Arden had 30 love, though. Yep. And that was when the double fault came. Well, she got two big first serves in to get to 30 love, then a double fault, and then the return game of Sharapova has picked up. So, a break point now for Sharapova to get even. serving to stay in this opening set now. Until the last shot. She could have hit that and had an open court to do so, but uh, a mental error there. He's pretty happy with that shot. She can't believe it. Well, that 
mental error. 15 love. 15, May prove very costly in this game. Well, Hennan Arden was the one in this match who was the first one to up the ante just a little bit, particularly off the ground strokes. And then Sharapova, to her credit, went with her. And Sharapova now is the one yep. that's gone on with it the last two games. Sharapova, Ken yeah. and Arden's throwing everything out of. We've got some sliced backhands. Fury's up out of his seat. As soon as that one went in the net, he jumped up. A couple of set points now for his daughter. going with the line call and it was a bad one it was well in a huge point set point it was a winning serve Neither player held serve in the early stages of a tense second set. We rejoin the action with Enna Arden looking to consolidate her break at 2-1. This is where she has to play a couple of tight points here. You don't feel like you've had a break until you consolidate no. and win your own serve. That's a good serve. <laughs> Seen an effective serve this whole match for Justine. Up the middle, cuts down the angle. I just think on that ball too, I mean, that's a perfect <laughs> shot for Hannah Arden to come to the net on. Yep. I mean, there's no way that Sharapova is going to be able to play an effective shot on the full stretch, or even if you do get a volley from Hannah Arden, it, it's going to be a volley that she can hit into the open court. Sharapova's the one that ends up at the net. Has all the time in the world, and Hannah Ardenge could have gone either way. Oh. Oh, better four points there. A very loose forehand to be down love 15, but Hannah Ardenge comes back. And now they lead three games to one. New balls now. That's oh, too good. <laughs> 156k as the serve was, but didn't Long really to go didn't. out there enough. Hen and Arden moved on the diagonal, cut the angle off, moved forward. She's pretty confident on that forehand wing now. 
That's where the errors were coming from earlier, but once she gets Love confidence, she has gone after them all. Love 30. And again, that time off the backhand. Low Set points, three of them. Fifteen, forty. Well, that one's second sets in Arden. Justin in Arden Six comes games, back with a vengeance in set number two, and she will serve first. In the third and final set, it's one set apiece in an Arden 6-1. Into a deciding set, it was Enna Arden who opened up a break of serve in the sixth game. We rejoin the action with the 2004 champion looking to consolidate a 4-2 break. The score, 4-2. Enna Arden, third set. Wishing that serve to be out, Sharapova. That was good. That's what a couple of bad calls will do for you. Begin to question anything that goes close. Yes, exactly right. 30-15. Yep. Too short. Tried to mix up the pace here, Sharapova, but just didn't get it anywhere near deep enough on that one there. That's mid-court. Yeah, well, confidence will do that for you with Enan Arden bouncing onto everything now. 40-15. It's too good. Um, Sharapova showing us that she can create some angle off the backhand side herself. That one there, 
Once Hen and Arden hit it hard, though, no chance to recover to the middle of the court. Sharapova moving forward. Game here, Sharapova. Excellent first serve up the middle. 179 kph. She is now serving for a place in the final. With a double break up her sleeve, a spot in the final was Enna Ardennes for the taking. We rejoin the action at 5-3 in the deciding set. And it will show. It show. Fourth double fault. Did not play here last year. Eleanor Den was the champion here in 2004. Opportunity like this, still, still the same. Breaking, yeah. and if anybody tells you it's not, they don't know what they're they talking about. They're, exactly. Yeah. If that's the case, they've never, never been there. Happens to everybody. <laughs> Serving for the match, love thirty. may have been a little deep. They were good, and she survives that point. So a double fault, then a wild volley, and a solid point here for 15.30.
now from Sharapova, though. The one that went up the line. Yeah, she had really to stay very low on that one, didn't certainly she? Certainly did. Caught Hen and Arden going to the backhand side. Oh, Even though she didn't put the volley away, I'd like to see her do that a little bit more. Tough to make yourself do that when it's not <laughs> your preferred coaches, way of playing. As I said, the coaches will show you they are nervous. It is now break point. Well, this is just the time when sometimes you've done the hard work and you've broken back and you go around and just ease off just a fraction. Get yourself in trouble. 15 all. Rodriguez is saying to Hannah Nardin. You've got to admire the tenacity of both these women. This has certainly been the best match that we've had throughout the tournament. Shake of hands from Maria Sharapova to 